Hello and welcome back from the Matrix. I love doing that. I'm Metroid Man. We are the Super Matrix Bros, and fucking Shriek Bats are here to murder us. Alright, welcome back to Let's Play Metroid Prime Scary Mushrooms. What were we doing last time? Uh, I just watched the last episode just because I knew that I was going to be playing this soon. When? Uh, when like a month it? ago. No, I meant like, when did we do it? A month ago, 250,000 years ago. Yeah. Oh, I remember where we were. I yeah, we went know. this way, I think. Mm -hmm. Yes, I don't remember those. Um, so it's definitely the uh, way. We went to the furnace. Where's the furnace? The we're, furnace. We're, st we're continuing That's safe station. Furnace. furnace, right. So we're going the right way. I remember you were getting something and then we were Right, 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 right. Yeah. Anyway, these bats suck. Shriek bats. It's like kamikaze bats. They suck at their AI. It just sucks. Oh, In Metroid Prime 2, it's a lot better. Which we'll be let's playing once we finish this one, which will be like never, but anyway. Alright, 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 alright. Alright, alright, alright. Why did I say that? I think, yeah. Oh, they're everywhere! They're the kamikaze bats. They're just saying they're, kamikaze. They're, they're, they're Al-Qaeda. They're... Why is this... What, what, did I already shoot it? Okay. Uh, fucking hallway. I don't know. That was a hard decision. I Why did I... Made that decision, because I have no idea which way they go. Oh, shit. Now we're in the furnace. We're going back. We're going back. This is not the furnace. The wrong, wrong way. We need to go to the spider ball way. All right, let's do that again. Spider-Man ball. Spider-Man bat. Spider-Man. Man bat is actually a character in Batman. He's he's a villain. Okay. Well. Like wow. These things are huge. These are like bigger than normal. They don't. No. Look at this. They're like halfway up my goddamn visor. Uh, last time we read this, chose a lore, and then you had to leave. So. Uh, there's a spider ball. Spiders. Oh, 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 these are the things. We didn't scan these yet. No, nope, no, nope, not that. Okay, well, this is... Alright. This is called a plated parasite. Yay. Uh, magnetic rail system track. Okay, amazing. Um, time to figure out how to get up there. <laughs> yeah. Time to, time to solve a puzzle. You have to blow that up. That's my guess. Well, I don't know how I'm going to do that. What? Boom! I can't blow it up. Where is that spider ball going? How am I gonna get up there? Right there. Where my where my where my thing is pointing. How am I gonna get up here? This is the start, obviously. Uh, huh. No. Okay. Definitely not. What if we jump from no oh, wait, you had to be a spider ball. Yeah, well, I can reach there. Oh, people think I'm so retarded now. I, I've i played this game before, trust me. Mm. It's not that we're not supposed to do this yet, because we are supposed to do this. This is the only thing left to do. Hmm. Oh. All right, let's do this. <laughs> Yay! Neon oh. lights. Ooh. Oh, fuck. Wow, you were right. Neon lights. Oh, this is nice lighting. This music, this music is ominous. Ominous music! Wrong button. <laughs> yeah. <gasps> Can't oh, scan everything. Shit. Is it a boss? I remember this place. It's a boss. There's so much Chozo lore. Aw, oh, damn it. Fuck. <laughs> this is gonna be Chozo lore 2.0! Look at this, okay? Wow. One, this two, three. <laughs> this is like the worst thing. Hey, you didn't I do the right voice for the last one. I don't remember even doing the voice for the last one. Oh, no, you did. But you did the wrong one. Completely wrong. Being that I can't find it. Because I don't well, remember which one it was. It sounded like a robot. Oh, well, there's presets, so I'm just going to keep using the preset now. No, don't use that same preset. No, there's no. That one sounded so bad. There's this multiple. Cordite no, statue like, is worn and weathered. There's presets. Now, if I remember Cordite. Shut your mouth. Okay, we get it. There's presets. Wait, okay, say it. Hmm? Say it. What oh, was your, what multiple was... presets on the, uh, the 
program that I didn't make. So we'll just Ah, oh, damn it. I activated something and now it's on a timer. Yay. Oh. Oh no it's not. Okay. Well, Spider-Ball figured out. Well, um, list. time for Chozo Lore 2.0. This stuff is really important, though. Oh, I don't know if this is in order. Oh, I hope this is in order. <laughs> we do it live. Chozo script translated. <clears throat> Many Chozo are gifted with the distant sight, and even more begin to learn it as our harmonization with the universe becomes more and more complete. We peer forward, seeing prophecy in the ripples of the water hearing rumors of coming days on the breath of the wind. Though we celebrate the distant sight, many of these visions are dark. The worst of the prophecies, and the most common, tells of the coming of the worm, born from parasites, nurtured in a poison womb. The worm grows, devouring from within until the world begins to rot. Not all prophecies come to pass, of course, but we cannot help but fear this dark portent. So yep. the worm is clearly the great poison that they speak of. Right? Or or is it within the great poison? Is it what controls the great poison? Huh. None know if our temple, the cradle, would prove powerful enough to contain this evil forever. For now, it wraps around the abomination cutting it off from the world above. However, we believe the power of S or Cypher, which has been produced by linking the 12 artifacts, which should be strong enough. The fate of this world is now left to the one who will collect the artifacts in the future. The time when the entrusted one knows is approaching. I wonder who that could be. Hmm, not us. Definitely not us. Those are just th those are just six marks. To the entrusted one, if you read these words, then our hope has not been in vain. Your path is fraught with danger. Monstrosities beyond description lurk in the shadows, starving, hunting for prey, searching for ways to quench the poisonous urges that bloom in their brains. Some of these are shrewd, but they are blinded by their evil designs. Believing in the black promise of the great poison, they seek to harness it for their own ends. It is these last that are the greatest danger. When you rid the universe of these creatures, you will be the true entrusted one. So that is clearly the space pirates that want to harness the evil that they were speaking of Why don't you for just its power. Blow up the planet. Wouldn't that be just I have to save the planet, and I'm not trying to save the planet. I'm trying to go for Ridley. If I just, I can't just blow up the planet because I don't have. It's not. It doesn't work that way. I can't just like bomb it and expect the entire planet to explode. No, I think that's exactly how it is. That's not how it is. <laughs> Every time the planet blows up in a Metro game, it's due to something else that is great that happens. And I love how this just straight up just stops. Look at this. It just stops in the middle of the air. Oh, great, now I'm stuck down here. Uh! Yay, graphic. She's like, ah, oh, we were too la lazy to finish the lines, so you know what? There there we go. That's good. <laughs> oh, this, this, this is, this is. Wrong weapon. What is this way? Sparkle effect. I don't know. I'm going to find out what this way is. Sparkle effect? This way is not sparkle effect. Definitely sparkle. Oh my! Oh no, I'm not prepared to fight this yet! I think you are. You have, you have energy tanks and stiff. And Mr. I'm Glowman. Well, it's not like I can see them! It's just Mr. Mm. I'm Glowman. just using the common. Oh my god! Anyway. Oh wait, what is this thing? Holy. Oh, yeah. hey. Chozo Ghost! <laughs> Man. It's a Chozo ghost. This doesn't. Oh, look, another Chozo lore. <laughs> I hate it. All of it. <laughs> Mr. Glowy Man, kill him. 
Ah, oh, we got it. We got it. We got it. Slow fall backwards. What is that? In real life, you know. Dude, what is that? It's called This Was Not Made by J.J. Abrams. Oh, shut up. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> shut up about J.J. Abrams. He's a good director with lots of lens flares. Yeah, because if, he, if this was directed by him, there'd be a lens flare right there. But it's not. That's that is joke. kind of a lens flare. That's the joke. I mean, it's before they had the technology to do lens flares. Identified as statue of a Chozo elder. According to Chozo lore, these statues served as the watchful guardians of tombs and shrines. <sighs> it is outstretched hands are empty, as if it's as if waiting an offering. I hey. could not read that last yes, part. Yes, so the times it is. Nah, there's one more Chozo lore. Fine. If we don't read it now, then it will be, have to be read in the next episode. To do it on either of them, so we might as well do it now. Things bound to an earthly shapes. Fuck, that was all. Things bound to earthly shapes are temporal and frail, existing in a single dimension. They are fragile, vulnerable, and ultimately mortal. However, not all things obey this law. Shapelessness. They wait to be. Shapeless, they wait to be on the realm of perception, emerging only when one arrives who can feel their presence. Such is the will of the Chozo. Our will to defeat the evil seeping into this planet remains. We desire only to see the darkness meet its end. The will of the Chozo has no mind or reasoning of its own. For... oh no. This will be the entrusted one's trial. Yes. Now it's time to end the episode. I don't know what you're talking about. I okay. Well, in the next episode, we're gonna figure out what this big blue lens flare thing J.J. Abrams' um soul is. But until then, we will see you. And don't click the button when we're done. We can just keep going. In. Don't click the button. The Matrix. Don't click the button. <laughs> oh, plug your ears. That wasn't that loud. My ears are bleeding. <laughs> uh. All right.